Hello friends, today we are going to read Bath Time for Chunnu and Munnu. The author is Rohini Nilekani. The illustrators are Sonal Goyal and Sumit Sakuja. The translator is Rohini Nilekani and the publisher is Story Weaver. So let's read Bath Time for Chunnu and Munnu. So who are Chunnu and Munnu in this picture? I think they are these two children that look like they are having fun in the bath. And this is their mother. Let's see what bath time looks like for them. Yay! It is bath time for Chunnu and Munnu. Today, Mama sings a new rhyme for Chunnu and Munnu. La, 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 la. So here in this picture, what do you see? You see this lady, this is the mother and she is filling these two tubs with water for bath time for these two kids. They are Chunnu and Munnu. They are siblings. This is the big brother and this is the little child and they are having a bath and it looks like they are playing, they're playing with toys, they're playing, splashing in the water and having fun. It is bath time for Chunnu and Munnu. Mama washes all the dirt off Chunnu and Munnu. Scrub a dub a dub. So here you can see they are having a bath. This is a little child and so the mother is washing this one whereas the other child is having his own bath and they are both having fun. It is bath time for Chunnu and Munnu. Soap bubbles and fun for Chunnu and Munnu. So here in this picture, you can see that they're having a lot of fun. This child is putting water on himself and there are bubbles flying around and they are bursting when this little baby is bursting them with his fingers and they are having a lot of fun. It is bath time for Chunnu and Munnu. Mama runs to catch naughty Chunnu and Munnu. Ha, 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 ha. So what's going on here? They are running away from the bathroom, away from the mother, and they are chasing each other, right? This one is chasing his big brother, and the mother is chasing after them. And they are laughing and running away. Bath time is over for Chunnu and Munnu. Mama hugs clean, clean Chunnu and Munnu. Hmm. Now bath time is over and both the children are covered with a towel and the mother is drying up this child and the other one is drying himself. Now they are both Clean, clean. They're very clean, right? Just after the bath and the mother is hugging them. Bath time is over for Chunnu and Munnu. But tying up pajamas is hard for Chunnu and Munnu. Oh, oh, ah. So what's going on here? Once they are clean and dry, now they have to get dressed. They have to wear pajamas for night. And wearing the pajamas are difficult because you have to know how to tie a knot. No, they are very little children. And so they have a hard time trying to tie the knot in the pajamas. 
and this one is being helped by his mother and this one is trying on his own to tie it. Bath time is over for Chunnu and Munnu. Yay! It is dinner time for Chunnu and Munnu. Yum, yum, yum! So here again are the two children and now it is dinner time. The mother is feeding the little one and the big brother is having fun eating on his own. Is he eating or is he playing? You see, he is taking this roti and there is a hole in it and he is looking through it and laughing at his little brother. And the little one is laughing, looking at what the big brother is doing. Dinner time is over for Chunnu and Munnu. Nana and Nani are waiting to kiss Chunnu and Munnu. Mwah, mwah, mwah. So, here are the little kids' grandparents, Nana and Nani. And they are now clean, dry, dressed and fed. Dinner time is over and Nana Nani are waiting. So the kids can come and hug them and the grandparents can kiss them. Mwah. Today's playtime is over for Chunnu and Munnu. Sweet dreams now for Chunnu and Munnu. So, here they are now tucked into bed. It is bedtime. They have played, they have had a bath, they have had their dinner and now it is time to go to bed. And now they will go to sleep and have sweet drinks. I hope you enjoyed this story. Thank you. The difficult words in this story are Rhyme, poem or song with words that end on the same sound like cat and hat. Scrub, to clean by rubbing hard. Try these questions. What are the different things you do daily like taking a bath or eating dinner? Write about your daily habits. Do you have a brother or sister? Do you do something daily with them? Write about it.